So here's our friends at Marlowe again. This is a California designation Cabernet, but it has so much more character. Yeah, than but you but think uh, but a lot of the grapes came from one area, and I can't I can't remember where, offhand. Well, it must be Sonoma. I think. Um, oh yeah, well it's it was it was bottled in, in Sonoma, <laughs> but yeah, and so are the grapes from the other from the shard. Yeah, yeah, I think I think a lot of grapes did come from Sonoma on this wine. Now the nose on this wine is a little brighter than what the actual palate tastes like to me. You get a lot more complexity than what the nose suggests. Oh wow, this is an ager. You know, this got some this mm. got some sock to it, mm. but not socks. Make no, sure that, that you would understand be, the difference between that would be, uh, socks and sock. So okay. we were at uh, the Strand House. You've been there yet? On the, the a fabulous house? restaurant. Really good. Fabulous food. restaurant in Hermosa Beach. And we were sitting at the bar Saturday night. I'm having uh, my usual gin martini, and she's having a glass of wine. And um, the, the bartender and the mate, the sommelier, were opening a bottle of uh, Zin. I can't remember which one of the big brands. And they both made a face like this. <laughs> Are we sure it was like that? And I go, corked? They go, yeah. They go, how'd you know? And I throw my car. They go, oh, well. So then they started bringing us stuff to taste. Yeah. He goes, you got to taste this. You got to taste this. You got to taste this. Well, the sous chef there is a great kid that, that, that studied under Robert Bell at Chez Melange. And when he was 17 years old, his parents, he really wanted, he had a passion for cooking. And his parents sent him to Italy for a year and a half. And he, he toured Italy cooking in different places. Wow. When he cool came back. He was telling Robert how to cook Italian food. That's really cool. And I'm telling you, it was the only time, and I've known Robert for 35, 36 years, I never saw him or heard of him listening to anybody, yeah. especially some 19-year-old kid, you know. But that's a cool experience, though, right? But, oh, and I'll tell you, when he came back, God, could that kid cook. I mean, he was really something. That's, that's pretty neat. <laughs> and he's doing some great things at the Strand House. It's really a phenomenal yeah. restaurant, and it's a phenomenal-looking restaurant. I mean, it's visually well, the stunning. The TI was, like, really expensive, you know what I ordered? I went there twice in the week, and I ordered the to barbecue tofu. I don't know why. I don't either. It was excellent. <laughs> it was. I ate the whole thing. It was absolutely excellent. That would be foreboding for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Marlo Cabernet Sauvignon, twenty six ninety nine on the shelf, eleven ninety nine. Yes, boys and girls, eleven ninety nine. Just at the Wine of the Month Club. Get yours today. Ninety six points. I gotta. I gotta revisit my business plan. Nice. Eleven ninety nine. Let me turn my phone off too. Okay, and last but least, the no! next the, the next foreboding wine, Howes.